Hey you guys, it's Rachel here with Sense of Tempo County Corso. So I'm out here with um, some of the dogs, not all the dogs. Um, it's been a hot minute since they've been allowed out. I've had everybody kenneled up for what seems like weeks while I was dealing with um, Trinity's puppies. And now that that's over with, I let everybody out. They've been hanging out with me while I've been cleaning today. <sighs> um, I have been packing up everything. I can't even tell you how much crap. Get out of that. No. Blondie, get out of it now. No. She's eating a cat poop. Out of it now. Get now. I think I'm going to put... I think I'm gonna try to put like a, what's it called? A, um, out, Man Mortigan. A, um, oh, what am I looking for the word? A fence, like a white picket kind of fence kind of thing here to block this off. I think that'll be a good idea. Oh, so, um, yeah, so I've been cleaning all day. Literally doing a deep clean on everything, sanitizing everything, throwing away everything. Because um, when you're dealing with a virus, it's better to just be safe than sorry. And so I've just been, you know, throwing away what I can. And then, um, and then boxing stuff up. Um, because basically even in the worst case scenario... If you box things up for six, seven months, you should be good. So, Batista, get out of here. Now, out. Um, so anyway, uh, Blondie, her heat is done. Um, she was not bred, as I told you guys that she wouldn't be. Um, Velocity is through with her heat, although she's put up right now. I'm um, not sure why, just kind of, Savannah and I have just been cleaning, and I guess she let her out and put her back up instead of just keeping her out. Um, and then Nirvana went through a heat as well. I guess she put Nirvana back up as well. No, Blondie, leave the chicken food alone now. So, Blondie, out, come here now. Blondie, now! Was oh, she stubborn? What did I say, Blondie? Did you hear what I said? You get your butt over here now. Move it. Now. You get over here now. Let's go. Blondie, all the way. She's like, why? What's the big deal? Blondie, over here. Woman? Shh. Blondie. Hey. Shh. What did I tell you? You better listen. Down. Down. You listen. Do as you're told. Anyway. <sighs> really, really, really tired. I felt bad for not making any videos recently, but unfortunately, I had to take some time for myself and reset. Um... And I've just been going through a lot. And so, uh, and so anyway, so that's why I couldn't, you know, couldn't do a video. I did. I just didn't feel that if, if I couldn't put out quality content, I just didn't want to do it. You know what I mean? Um, and so, I got a collar here. I saw, so wild, man. I've, I've it feels like. <laughs> It feels like winter just hit. I'm I'm just so shocked that the grass is starting to get green again. Um, it just it just doesn't. It feels like it hap It went too fast, you know. And um, I don't know. So I really need to focus on moving. Um, and I want to get a good price for my property. And so I've been kind of um, thinking about, you know, like what else 
could I do? And so I was looking, they had a bunch of like rose bushes and stuff. And um, the people are, you know, everybody's starting to plant now. And so I think what I'm going to do is, um, I think what I'm going to do is basically, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this area here and I'm going to put some roses in there and then put like a, like a white, like a picket fence around it and then do a picket fence around that. I don't know if anything survived from in there or not, so I guess I'll have to see. Um, it'll be interesting. And then I think instead of doing plants and stuff in this garden over here, um, I think what I'm going to do is uh, just put some rose bushes in it. Um, show you guys all the trash that we've collected. We're fixing to do a trash run. So I'll show you guys all the, the trash that I collected during this process. This entire porch is full of trash. Just bags and bags and bags of contaminated stuff. Um, whelping boxes that we're going to be tossing. I have to start fresh with everything. So that's part of, call it the big reset. <laughs> um, so anyway, so yeah, that's just kind of where we're at. Um, so anyway, well, I'm not gonna do a long video today because I really don't have much to talk about. I'm, I'm actually super exhausted. My back is killing me because I've been cleaning all day. I rearranged my room just so that I can kind of, um, it's not, the memories aren't there, if you know what I mean? Uh, kind of just a fresh start. And so, uh, so anyway, Bella, hey, hey, oh, don't you chase that chicken, you bad dog. What were you thinking? What were you thinking, Bella? Oh, hey, hey, hey. Bad blondie. Let Pre Batista leave her alone. Bella, come here, baby. Poor baby. Come here, baby. Come here, sugars. What? Bella, come here. You're all right. You're all right. Come here. Come here. Let me see your face. Let me see your face. We'll play baby. Little baby. Oh, I know you were chasing chickens, but you didn't deserve that. You got a little hole in your head. She got a little mark right there on her. Yep. Mm. Poor baby. Yeah, Blondie has just been like ruthless lately, man. Just straight, straight ruthless. Um, look at her. Give her a side look just there. Yeah, she has been super dominant lately. She is fully... Hey, Blondie, I will mess you up if you hurt that dog again for no good God reason. You understand me? If I had teeth, I would get you in the nose. Just like you did her. Leave that poor baby alone. Mm -hmm. Poor baby, Bella. Poor baby Bella. Are you a poor baby? Are you a poor baby? You're a baby. You're a dirty girl. You're a dirty girl. I'm a poor baby. I'm a poor baby. No, I don't feel sorry for you, Blondie. You're a bad dog. You were too mean. You're too mean. Maybe. I don't know. I'm emotional right now. She wasn't being mean. It's just. Hey, Bella, don't chase chickens. Look at me over here acting like, like so many of my viewers that I often get mad at for, you know, humanizing the dogs. The reality is that Blondie knew that um, Belladonna did something she wasn't supposed to do. Her energy got too high 
and Blondie went to give her a correction, and Belladonna was kind of dramatic about it, um, because she's fine, but, but anyway, I'm, I'm not at my strongest point right now either, so emotionally, normally I'm tougher, but I'm just also, like I said, also kind of emotional, so anyway, well, Batista, mind your manners. She ain't got no manners, Mama. We should know that. Mm. Batista. He acts like he wants to play, but we all know he don't. Yeah, he don't want to play. No part of him wants to. Oh, look at him drop it. He's. Oh, bloody stick. Hey, back off my stick. Look at my stick now. Blondie is really, really matured into a very strong dog emotionally. She don't take no crap off nobody. But Batista, get out of it. Out, Batista. Good boy, Batista. You being a good boy? You being a good boy? Yeah. Uh, dude, whoa, watch your mouth. Watch your mouth. Bella, chill out before you get in trouble again. Hey, watch out for my tree, Batista. There's a tense moment there between those boys. To see how big my Mortigan is for being just a baby. Batista's like two years old and my Mortigan's only a year old. And Batista's still not even done growing, if that tells you anything. He's just being a hoonigan. Oh, oh, boom. And, oh, wow. Do you see Bella? Yeah. She almost ran right into... Hey, Preacher, both of you, down now. You know what you did. Get down now. Don't you give me side eye. All the way down. You know what you did. You know better. Don't start crap with Batista. Don't start crap with him. Okay. What? Did she run into it or did she She jumped over it. Blondie, what are you doing? Don't be doing all that mess. Look at her eating it. Hey, oh, Blondie, what'd I tell you about that? Get out of the cat litter right now. Oh, you dirty mouth girl. Dirty poopy dog. Poop eater, you're a bad dog. You're a nasty girl. That's right. I hope it got all up in your nose and made you sneeze. Bad girl. Stinky breath girl. Anyway, alright. I'm gonna let y'all go. I'm tired. I'm gonna go inside. No, don't you come over here to apologize to me. I don't feel sorry for you. Alright, y'all. You have a good day. Bye.